It was during the holiday break a couple of years ago that the Gibson family plans nearly fell apart. Aria was set to star in a school play and her parents had booked a surprise trip to Disney when suddenly Aria was rushed to the hospital. They checked her out and did uh, an ultrasound and they told us that she did have appendicitis. Normally that means emergency surgery within hours and a recovery that can take weeks. Luckily, Aria was at Nationwide Children's Hospital where doctors conducted the first study in the U.S. to see if they could skip surgery and treat appendicitis using only antibiotics. At least at the end of a year, we know that over three out of four, more than 75% of kids who chose antibiotics did not have to have surgery. Whether it's surgery or antibiotics, Dr. Kate Deans and Dr. Pete Minecci say parents need to pick the method that best suits their family. It's really a matter of aligning your preferences, your values, your biases, what you think is most important to you with the therapy that's best for you and your family. If we don't have to have surgery, if they don't have to be in, in pain, if we don't have to have the risk of surgery or anesthesia, it was worth a, a try. It's been two years since Aria's bout with appendicitis. She may be too young to appreciate the novel approach doctors took to treat her, but her family will never forget the experiences they shared as a result. It was amazing. So she was able to do her musical and then we were able to go to Disney World with no problems and <laughs> we were really thankful that that was an option for us. I feel great. There's nothing, I haven't experienced anything else. I haven't, it hasn't hurt or anything. At Nationwide Children's Hospital, this is Clark Powell reporting.